Kazuki, you'll have answered lots of questions already since your news uh, from earlier in the week that you're stepping down from your driving role at Toyota and, and pursuing some new challenges within the company. Tell us, first of all, how you came about this decision and a little bit about the incredible chapter of your career that has been Toyota. Yeah, first of all, uh, many, many thanks to everyone who had uh, supported me uh, for all, all of my career, especially Toyota, Toyota Gaz Racing, and all, my, all of my uh, teammates uh, in here, and uh, you guys as well, and all the fans. So yeah, thanks for, for all the support. And then, yeah, how it come up, uh, yeah, I have to say, of course, as a race car driver, I was wanted to you know, continue racing forever, but uh, especially uh, seeing, uh, you know, the week we were facing new era, which is uh, the, the great time with a lot of competitions coming. So in a way I was yeah, wishing that I could have uh, continued uh, racing, but at the same time, as uh, Toyota Gazoo Racing, uh, we are looking for uh, many changes and uh, one uh, big task of us is uh, develop uh, the new generation and uh, in the end, uh, our view was uh, together that it's the right time to make a change now uh, to be ready for the new uh, competition time. So that's uh, basically what happened. And uh, I'm, uh, of course, sad to uh, live here as a race car driver, but also I'm uh, looking uh, ahead to the future. Uh, and I'm sure I'll be around uh, yeah, in Wake Paddock uh, I don't know the role yet, but uh, that's my hope, so, yeah. What do you see specifically as your, your strengths and your knowledge that you've gained in your career in, in a new role, potentially, with, with the team or even in other aspects of motorsport? What would you like to achieve? Yeah, I mean, I've learned a lot uh, in this uh, work paddock for the last 10 years, and uh, I've worked with the team, I've worked with the driver, and also... Uh, myself, I basically grown up uh, from young kid to be, I don't know if I'm mature or not, but a uh, mature driver at the moment. So I think, yeah, I can help uh, maybe young drivers to uh, build up the knowledge or the experience or I don't know. I think there's many thing, uh, things I can help uh, them. So yeah, I don't know the role will be, but uh, I'm, I'm happy to be part of this team and uh, to help them all. And when you look back on what is almost a decade of, of racing with Toyota, there must be lots of highlights, lots of memories, but is there one that particularly sticks out, a memory or a race or a, a campaign? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's hard to pick up one moment and uh, it's the choice uh, either you pick up the, the best moment or the worst moment. But uh, <laughs> I, I, I would pick up uh, 16 Le Mans still, uh, which was maybe the worst moment uh, which you can ever imagine. But at the same time, I believe this was a key point for us to to build up the stronger team and to be ready for the first thing which happened in 18. And only, you know, regret or uh, what I missed is uh, actually, yeah, Anthony Davidson had an announcement of retirement this week and it just reminded me at that time and uh, we somehow, I mean, myself and Seb managed to win the race later, but uh, yeah, uh, I just missed the opportunity to win the race together with Anthony at that time. So it just made me think about this and it made me a bit uh, emotional. But uh, yeah, if I pick up one moment, yeah, I would pick up this race, yeah. <laughs>